Hey, what's going on guys? Let's look at this problem right here. This question is asking, locate the image of an object placed 1.2 meter from the vertex of a gypsy crystal ball, which has a 20 centimeter diameter. Make a sketch. The sketch is already here. And also we have now the general equation for a curved su surface that's given by N2 over SI1 minus N2 over SO1 is equal to n2 minus n1 over r1 here n1 is refractive index of the air n2 is refractive index of the ball and so1 is the object distance from the first surface of the ball and si1 is the image distance from the first surface of the ball okay that's already mentioned in the diagram now let's go ahead and plug the values in this equation here they have given the diameter right we have the diameter that is object is placed 1.2 meter and also the diameter is 20 centimeter so if the diameter is 20 centimeter then radius is going to be half of this value in meter that's going to be 0 0.2 meter and therefore radius is going to be 0 0.1 meter so we can go ahead and plug this value in the equation and n2 is refractive index of this one that is 1.5 so this is going to be 1.5 divided by si1 minus refractive index this should be n1 right here this should be n1 n1 is refractive index of the air that is 1 divided by so1 that's going to be negative 1.2 and then n2 again that's going to be 1.5 minus 1 divided by the radius that's going to be 0 0.1 and if you solve for si1 you're going to get 0 0.36 okay and from this one if si1 is equal to 0 0.36 from this diagram you can see if si1 is equal to 0. Point, si1 is here okay si1 is 0. 0.36 and uh, we can calculate so2 right because diameter if you subtract diameter from si1 that's going to give you the so2 distance and diameter is 0. 0.2 right and if we subtract 0. 0.2 from this one that's going to give us so2 that's equal to 0. 0.16 so we have SI1, SO2 and uh, in the question they have asked to locate the image of an object placed. Okay, so we are trying to find image distance. Our purpose is to find SI2. Right, so we found out SI1. Now we had to create the equation for the second surface. Now for the second surface the equation is going to look like this. Since this is a curved surface, N1 over SI2 minus n2 over so2 is equal to n1 minus n2 over r2 now our purpose is to find si2 we have n1 that is the refractive index of air n2 is the refractive index index of the ball and so2 we calculated that is 0 0.16 and r2 is basically 0 0.1 right so we can plug it plug it here and find the final answer so this is going to be 1 over si2 minus 1.5 over 0 0.16 is equal to negative 0 0.5 divided by negative 0 0.1 and that's going to give us SI2 is equal to 0 0.07 meter in centimeter that's going to be 7 centimeter and this is going to be inverted because, because the answer is positive so this is going to be inverted and it's going to be the right of the second surface and that's how we do this kind of problems I hope this helps thanks for watching let's mention inverted